guys my name is Tamaris Nema welcome back to my channel and if you're new here please don't forget to comment like share and subscribe <laughs> okay guys so today I want us to talk about something very 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 interesting so I'm gonna be talking about common things that actually couples fight about yes so guys if you want to test your marriage or real relationship <laughs> Try do doing a DIY project together. My God, <laughs> yeah, just pick something like just tell your your partner. You know what? L let's make a table together. Something like that. Oh my God, that never goes well. Trust me, because you have your opinion, they have their opinion, and then you kind of conflict. So that one usually it will test your relationship. <laughs> So go try it out and tell me. <laughs> the other thing I'll actually tell you is driving. Especially when the lady is the one who's driving. I don't know what's up, what, what's up with guys thinking that we ladies, we are just not good at driving. So they always have to like teach us or remind us or just correct us. Especially on, on the wheel. I mean, that is really, really annoying. Personally, I hate it. So just to avoid the conflict. Whenever I have to go somewhere with my husband, he'll be the one doing the driving. But when I go alone or with my son, I do the, I'm okay. But with him, I'm always on tour. Like I question my driving, I question myself, I question my whole existence because I know he will just find something odd and just make it a big deal. But guys, you need to stop. <laughs> The other thing that couples usually really fight about is working out together. Yes. Have you ever had to work out with your partner at home or just maybe at the gym? You will hate it. <laughs> because they will always, I don't know, small things, the way you work out, like, oh, you're doing it wrong. Oh, the, it's supposed to be 10, 10 minutes. You did it for nine minutes. It always just be something small that will make you feel so angry or just make you argue so yeah <laughs> that's the other thing and the other thing one of the most common things actually it's a phone yes phones guys if you want to die young or if you're just looking for something to like stress you <laughs> or if you're just looking maybe your life is boring and you just want some drama <laughs> yeah Go through your partner's phone. That one is a, it's a sure deal. I'm telling you. Especially these young couples. Oh my God. If you want to die young. If you're looking for blood pressure or something. Just go through your partner's phone. And you'll definitely get it. And the other thing is actually making your partner like your teacher. Maybe it might be a study or like working out or just just something in general and then we'll be like oh, you know what my, my spouse is actually good at this so i should make him or her my part my like my teacher no guys <laughs> that's one of the things that actually couples fight about because your partner will be like there's a reason why you chose me to be your teacher so let me teach you and they're usually really rough I don't know what's up with that but making your partner your teacher either in anything for example like you don't know how to drive and you want to start to learn how to drive so you'll be like oh my partner will teach me um unless you have some percentage of patient or tolerance in you that you're gonna take everything in then maybe you should go for it. But if you're soft-hearted or you, you kind of feel hurt very easily, don't go for it. Yeah. So, guys, I guess that's it. I know there's so many, but um, let me know. Let me know what you think. And let me know what you've gone through. Or maybe you've had someone go through and it's just related to your situation. Let me know in the comment section below. <laughs> okay, guys, I'll see you later. Bye. Oh, guys. Real quick before I go, I'm still working out and I'm seeing results. So this is my second week. I've, I'm, I'm, I'm almost done with the first week. Now I'm entering the second week. 
and I'll let you know how it goes. Toodles, bye.